Right, hello YouTube, I'm going to tell you how to um, remove the redirect virus from internet, Google Chrome, Firefox, whatever, any internet browser. So, um, the redirect virus is where you type in any website on the internet and when you click it, like the link, it just takes you to some like credit card website, survey or some random website that you didn't even ask for. Now they get the redirect virus gets on there by visiting a like um unsecure website, downloading some uh, something and it might give you a virus or something like that. Now to take it off, you're gonna start off by downloading CC Cleaner and a program called um Mylobite anti malware, whatever it says. It'll be in the description both of these. Um, they're both free and yeah that's going to remove it so start off by going to control panel network and internet change your home page and it should come up the screen like this make sure you get a screen like that now whatever your home page is change it so I might want um, YouTube for example um, all your browsing history and when you've done that just click OK. Now that's done um, you're going to go to computer, um, C drive, go to program files 86 then find um, drivers I think it is. So it's not program files 86 it is just program files I believe wait mm, no it's not it's windows sorry first of all it's windows and then you go to drivers um, where is no it's system 32 um, then you go down so much folders everywhere So find your system 32, then go to just drivers, and then go to etc, then get this host, um, right click, and copy, and paste it onto your desktop, just paste like that, then minimize this so you don't have to go back. Now I'll double click it, and it say what do you want to open it, just open it with notepad or whatever. notepad. Now it should come up with all of this. Now yours should be exactly the same as mine. I mean, um, if you have anything from localhost, then take it away. If you if you have exactly the same writing, but your cursor's down here, make sure you take away the spaces so it's up to localhost. I mean, I found a thing like some numbers like that. Or it was something like that. Like I don't know what that was. That's just some random thing. But yeah, make sure it only goes up to here and it just says local host and it only uh, uh, has here. And then when you've done that and you've taken away all below this, if if you don't have anything here, that's fine. Uh, uh, but most people do. Just take away anything below the local host and make sure there's, there's no spaces under here. And when you've done that, just save it, close it, um, open up that thing, thing back here and drag and drop and then click move and replace but I've done that so I don't need to do that then just close it and now open the CC cleaner these are the most important bits of it all just open the CC cleaner and then just click yes if it asks um, now whatever's highlighted just make sure it is but if you just yeah make sure all of these in uh, these ones are all like checked everything like this make sure all the internet explorer one are checked and you can uncheck all these if you really don't want to they just clean up everything and then just click analyze and then it just analyzes everything and just checks for it all then when it gets to the end, uh, as you might see down here, there's a thing called Run Cleaner. Um, when it gets to 100%, you'll be able to run the cleaner, and it just cleans everything up. But I don't need to do that. 
Now when you've done that and you've run the cleaner, that just clears some most stuff. Open this mile by malware. Now when that opens it every whenever you install this, it's gonna sit down here in the background, like down here. And whenever you and it's always gonna block the uh, unrecognized IP addresses for any website. So when you've done that, um you'll see all these different things at the top. Right, look, uh, these are all Trojans that have been blocked for me. Um, yeah. What you need to do is you need to just click Perform Full Time Scan and then click Scan. Um, you can do C Drive. Make sure you have the C side. Just make sure both of these are clicked. Or if you want to make it go faster, just a C Drive because you don't really need to do the D Drive, but it is recommended. Then click Scan, and it just scans everything and what if it scans any trojans or anything like that any unwanted files that shouldn't be there it just removes them and that's the good thing and then um, wait till that gets to the end don't exit it and then uh, it'll tell you what to do from there and that will all remove it but I've already done that so I'm going to exit now for all, usually it sits down here you can exit but I, um, if you exit it you might have to redirect to virus but I very much doubt it you can still keep like delete it, but you might as well have it down there because it blocks random websites that like pop up. It come up every now and again. Just a little thing around here saying blocked IP to this. Okay, now when you've done that, um, you shouldn't really have to redirect the virus. Um, if it helps and it works, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next tutorial.